All right, guys, so basically what we're going to try to do today is teach you guys how to bicycle an ATV. So, oh, come on, dogs. This is just my preference, but I'm going to make a left-hand turn, and I'm going to bring it up on its right side. So, as you'll see uh, here in a minute, when I get the quad up, if I'm like this, it'll want to turn left automatically. If I go a little more vertical, it'll get a wider and wider turn left until eventually it'll run straight and if I get even further up for whatever reason we can start turning right it's a little sketchy but we'll get there there's not as many steps to doing a bicycle as there is a wheelie so I really don't know what they are other than full commitment and just try to not f flip the full wheeler but uh, we're gonna give it a shot so let's see what happens Yeah, so it's like, it's kind of hard to describe, but you can do it sitting or standing, but it's really just about commitment. Kind of just do like a quick, oh, it's a little wet down here. You do a quick little run and you stand it up. You may have to find a better spot. Yeah, I think it's too wet down here. Let's move. Maybe we can do it right here. Yeah, let's move to a different spot. Alrighty, moved over to the field. Let's see if we can do it a little better here. Honestly, the YFZ is so wide and it's got good power, it's kind of hard to do it. It wants to just spin around. I may get a different four wheeler to show you. I haven't done it much on this four wheeler either. All right, let's do it sitting down, see if that's easier. Nope. Okay. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it as good as I normally can to show you guys good, good examples. Might have to get a different four wheeler. Yeah, let's try a different four wheeler. Gosh. All right, we're back. And uh, Alexa, I took your four wheeler. Thanks. All right, so the 250 is more narrow. And look at that, sits right up. And if I lean over, I start going straight. If I lean far enough, oh, it doesn't want to turn uphill. Okay. Let's try to do it right in front of the camera. If I lean far enough, it'll go straight. If I go further, it'll come back to the right. Alrighty, so. It's uh, kind of a full commitment thing. You go right on the edge of wanting to flip, and then find a balance. And I'm just now noticing I kind of work the wheel a little bit. And that's just to help me find that balance. You definitely don't want to get going too fast. It's probably not too good to have the full wheeler on its side for a long time like that, honestly, because you're uh, washing all the oil to one side, but yeah. You can do them really tight. But if you go too tight, you'll start trying to do a donut. Yeah, it's just, it's a lot like wheelies. You really gotta commit
first gear, go slow, take your time. Woo! <laughs> this is why I love 250s, man. They're so much fun to toy around on. tried to bring it all the way back to you <laughs> all right so i really don't know how to i really don't know how to explain everything it's just commit to it uh try to flip it but don't flip it too hard <laughs> um of course i'm not a professional i don't do stunts and tricks for youtube or anything like i just like riding four-wheelers so um if you try this be safe don't follow my advice because I'm not a professional, okay? But be safe, have fun. Thanks.